Another special vehicle that can be found on the crew too is a helicopter. A helicopter. Yes. For some reason, they've decided to add the live helicopter as a usable vehicle, which makes total sense if they've got the vehicle available to, to in the game as, like, actual kind of showing in the cutscenes. What's the, what? Make, let us fly it. We're going to mow it if we're not able to fly it. So a helicopter is a, you're able to, to fly it. I don't know if you were able to use it in events. Can you upgrade it? There's so many questions on my mind about this. Unfortunately, this is probably the most limited gameplay footage I have for a special vehicle, which is a shame because I think this is one of the coolest. I mean, to, to be fair, they're all pretty darn cool. But this one in particular means we're going to be able to do some proper cool camera angles, follow people, spectate. It's just got so much in this that we can possibly do. Even just being able to fly directly upwards is so much easier than flying with a plane. Because if we will show you some planes for comparison in a minute, but this is just... I have no words for this. This is, this is crazy. Like, imagine having this and, like, having it hover somewhere and then in play for the planes, have the planes kind of fly past... It's fantastic. And in the first person view as well, a proper helicopter mode, unfortunately, as I said. Definitely the most limited gameplay footage I have. Really, I didn't want to do it again because there wasn't much point in doing it again. Because if I went back the other way or the other way, it was all desert everywhere. So, I didn't particularly think it would be really worth it to, to, to carry on. So, this is a plane, for example. I wanted to compare it to the plane. We do go back to the helicopter footage a little bit later in the video, but... I wanted to show the plane. Obviously, the plane is a little bit different in the fact that you're going to be going quicker. The, the planes handle much better, in my opinion, than the helicopter. But the helicopter is not made for maneuverability and all these kind of tight corners and stuff. This is a stunt plane. This is exactly what it's made to do. Whereas with the, the helicopter, you're supposed to... Well, it's just a helicopter. Usually, they're used for cameras, that sort of thing. Like, steady kind of movements of cool kind of panning shots. I like to think of the helicopter as almost the drone of this. The drone that we're going to be using to to get some really cool shots. Helicopter will be really cool for keeping up with vehicles going decent speed. A plane, I feel like, would go too too fast. And if you were following, chasing a car with a, a helicopter or close to the road, it would do better than a plane. So there's a lot of uses for the helicopter. And also, I want to see if we can pile some cars on top of it and send it up. I just want to try all these... It's like weird out of the blue things and having a vehicle like this is just out of the ordinary because normally it's you know there's there's, there's a, a lot of cars a lot of bikes a lot of boats a lot of planes to then add the special vehicles like the f1 car there's only two of those there's the helicopter and obviously there's also the hovercraft the hovercraft is definitely i'd say personally from the amount of usage i'm going to get from them the helicopter and the hovercraft are the two that are on my mind. Like, the hovercraft will get some crazy... Like, both of them will get some crazy, crazy kind of camera angles, that sort of thing. Even the monster trucks would, would be pretty good at that as well. But I think the helicopter for the higher-up stuff and the hovercraft for the chasing over different terrains. Even, like, following boats, I think, would feel better in a hovercraft. Anyway, uh, we have some old footage coming on now. This is from the, the A3 build, as I mentioned in the previous video. I want to switch the planes. And I flew these planes... Much better than I did it than I did at the last event, and I want to show you exactly how a smooth magic can fly a plane if he properly tries it. And it's to show you that this this plane is designed for maneuverability. And then when we'll go back to the helicopter footage, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about when it comes to. It's not really the most maneuverable thing in the world. You probably want to make slight adjustments and keep it locked at that kind of angle, otherwise it might be a little bit stuttery. But Hey, we'll, we'll, we'll see as we actually play around with the helicopter. I want to know how fast it actually is compared to a slower plane, maybe. But there's obviously a lot of fast planes in this game. Is it going to keep up with boats? Everything. I need to know. But this, this, this is basically the testing the waters video using what we have. I, again, I do wish... I definitely wish I would have put more time into actually flying the helicopter. And I wish I could have progressed further enough in the game to be able to unlock it and take it elsewhere. But... Hopefully in the in the beta and the full game we'll be able to do that. Beta, by the way, you want you might want to register for closed beta. It's coming super soon. I'm excited. And apparently there's no NDA, so I'll be able to film it as well. And you guys can join in. Maybe we can have some multiplayer sessions together, some streams, all that kind of stuff. But anyway, as I was mentioning, back to the helicopter now. You can see from that fluent movement that was just happening, we now have this very staticky locked movement. When you put it in a position, it's holding that position. It's keeping that kind of momentum. 
it's 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 different. It's very different. You can tell from this footage alone. And again, I'm hoping to be able to to get this at my hands on this very soon, so I can fly it in the cities, fly it over water, follow some cars, get an idea of how I'm actually going to make use of this vehicle. And I'm hoping that this is the beginning and, and, and only just the testing of the waters for different types of vehicle. I would like to see jet skis. I would like to see quad bikes. I'd like to see things like that, as I've mentioned before, filling in some gaps that these th vehicles definitely filled themselves. Next up, where's the hydro where it just goes up? VTOL, is that what it's called? Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, my friends, you know what to do already. Smash a like, subscribe if you are new, and let me know of all the special vehicles I've shown thus far, which is your favorite and why, what is your main use for that type of vehicle. But yeah, see you guys in the next video. Until then, peace.